I have the honor and privilege to um, serve as a tribal council member, also a white task force representative, and I hold some other um, positions with the tribe, um, working on different projects. Well, tonight is one of our um, nights that have been practiced for thousands of years by our, our ancestors, and it's the opportunity to go out onto the water and um, uh, harvest uh, only what you need, not harvest just because the fish are there, but you know, the, the man and spirits, you know, are watching over us tonight. And we want to make sure we offer our asema for protection on the water, for, for protection of the other spears, fishermen on the lake tonight, and also to um, um, uh, show respect for, um, you know, the water. We'll be going out there tonight, and we want to make sure we go out there and harvest in a good way and not to offend any of those spirits. Well, it's, you know, this is this is the fun part. You know, there's a lot more to it than that. You know, it takes time to um, process those fish, clean them, get them ready to um, to share with family, friends, elders, and other community members. And it's it's not, you know, just try to get it for yourself. It's about providing for your community. And a lot of tribal spears um, do that today. You know, the ones that can go out, the elders, um, disabled, you know, families that don't have um, the equipment to go out and harvest for themselves. You know, that's what we're here to, to provide for. Well, this is just part of the overall, you know, seasons in which we harvest. Um, you know, in the fall time, we gather wild rice, we gather deer, you know, we gather other species that help us make it through the winters. Um, you know, winter time, a lot of tribal members go out and ice spear, you know, fish on the ice. Uh, springtime sort of allows that um, sugar bush uh, gathering to go on, you know, where we gather sat to make syrup um, and this is you know spring spearing like is just one of those seasons where we continue to harvest and provide for our communities.